teachers, they will end up walking the streets. She wants the people who own this building to pay their taxes. Elementary, a teacher, Rahima Abdel Hamad, who is part of the effort to bring a school that was failing up to the higher levels. Here's a woman who is part of a concerted faculty effort and who has been given her pink slip. Rahima! a very dedicated third grade teacher at Malcolm X Academy, which is in Hunter's Point. I have been a teacher for 10 years, eight of those years in San Francisco Unified, and I have just received a pink slip. Despite the stigma that has been put on schools in Hunter's Point, we have done tremendous gains on a closing the achievement gap. This has been done in part by some support from the state, but primarily due to the hard work and dedication of the teachers and staff that support all of our students. Okay. And that the support of these teachers transcends the stigma that exists in Hunter's Point. Today, our students face the challenges of poverty, violence, hunger, and the fact that families are overworked and underserved. Even with these challenges, Malcolm X is one of the most improved schools in the entire state of California. This is not only due to the hard work and dedication of teachers and staff and students, but also to the trust that is built with valued homeschool relationships. These relationships are being compromised with these layoffs. This trust and continuity is in jeopardy with this current situation. This trust and continuity is under attack because corporations, banks, and wealthy landholders are not paying their fair share. right over here is trying to lower the property values which would cost our schools not only an extreme amount of money for our budgets but also the welfare and funding for our children. Yes, this is a very personal issue for me, but it is an issue that affects all of us. Do we really want to live in a society that devalues our children and schools while benefiting the elite? Take a stand with me to hold the corporations accountable. Thank you. That's right. Thank you very much. We now turn the microphone.